Say your name, please, and how you're connected with the Boulder Heights community. Uh, my name is Sofia Tatiana Alvarez, and I'm connected through community in a couple of ways. My mom, uh, my grandma, they lived here in the 50s for a while. And um, I also started recently working at a community organization or nonprofit at the Wellness Center. Um, and it's been a really interesting intersection of how those two came to be. Uh, I feel like I've gotten to know a part of my mom and my family through moving here. So, yeah. And um, do you currently live here? Yeah, so I moved from uh, Orange County to, to Los Angeles to be closer to work, but um, I never really spent much time in Los Angeles, and I know I have family here, and so I think moving here and just being around community and driving around and going to eat at, you know, taqueria or going to the corner store, I feel like I've gotten to know my mom and understand her and where she grew up. And that part of the mosaic of who my family is has been slowly filling in. And that's been really a beautiful thing to like discover on my own. It's like a part of your identity. Yeah, I feel like I've returned to to discover more of who my, like my family roots were and um, and discovering this being part of my identity. Like it's fine, I'm finding it here. And uh, any memorable stories that you want to share about Holy Hearts? Um, I don't think I have any yet, and right. I think I'm looking forward to changing that though. And when you hear of Boyle Heights community, what sounds do you think of? I think of like a warm hum, kind of like a street lamp at night where it has like a warm, like, a, like the electricity current is going through it, but it's almost harmonizing with other areas of like the block. Um, so it never really feels quiet, but it feels harmonious at the same time. Anything else you'd like to share? Yes. No, I'm just really happy to. I'm really happy to be here. This is my first time coming to a community event like this here, and um, I feel really proud to be Latinx. I really feel really proud to have family who's from here and get to discover that part of my identity. It's bringing me closer to them. And I, we've moved. You know, I moved and I've I've lived out of the house for so long. And I came back over the past year for the pandemic to live with my abuela. She's 91 years old. She's going to be 92 in November. And um, I, I miss them, you know? But being here at the same time feels like it's bringing me closer. Being a little far away. So yeah, I'm just happy to be here. Really thankful. Thank you. Thank you for sharing. Thank you.